So let's get rid of Windows Home and let's get some Windows Pro. Copy and paste my code from the description. New codes, new discount. You can get Windows Professional Office. Paste my code. Boom. It's Windows Pro time. Righto, tell you there, champs. Now, excuse this bit of mess here, this ghetto rig setup here. I've been actually messing around with Thunderbolt 3. Uh, connecting them to certain computers with that one. I've been connecting that one to the Alienware, whatever. So anyway, this thing friggin' surprised me, actually annoyed me, spend all this money on this friggin' RTX crap. Oh, and now you're gonna see this MacBook Pro with, yeah, all right, it's a Vega graphics. I'll actually show you what graphics card I got. I went and got one of these. Yeah, mining special off some bloke, second hand, 500 bucks, probably minor. Who knows? Anyway, <laughs> this is the same project, and let's have a look here at the scores, all right? So I'll just try and move that light away, get away light. All right, so if we have a look at these um, scores, now you can see there, four minutes and six seconds, hardware encoding, RTX 2080 Ti with an i9-9900K. This is overclocked, by the way. Um, Stock scores are a little bit slower anyway, but even this one, a 10 core, okay, four minutes 58. That's a 10 core, 7900K, and that was with the Titan X. And look, if the fastest laptop now is six minutes, is it? No, uh, eight minutes and 16 seconds, and hardware encoding is four minutes and 42. But if you have a look at the MacBook Pro with the Vega, yeah, it's eight minutes 59, open CL with metal, nine minutes 30. 6 minutes 33 hardware encoding. Now you would think this, this Western Gents United Cable Management Pro special here with a 9900K and an RTX 2080, you think it's gonna blow away this laptop. Even though it's connected to Vega, it's, it's a Vega, whatever, 64. A Vega 64 is nowhere near as powerful as an RTX 2080. The, the CPU in this, okay, is nowhere near as powerful as a 9900K. It's got an extra two cores. It, you know, it goes to five gigahertz. It can, you know, do 4.5 easily. Whereas this one, you know, if you're rendering all cores, you're only gonna get around three gigahertz and it's only got six cores. So this should smash this, right? Especially in Premiere, right? Well, let's find out. Let's go to the same project. All right, so let's get in there. I didn't, I couldn't find a better way to film this. So anyway, so it's, we're just going to export it. It's going to just go here. Look, I haven't messed around with the settings. I'll go there, and I'll go to 4K Ultra. And the important thing here is that hardware encoding is enabled. So hardware encoding is enabled. Okay, so that's ready. Go over to the PC. Do the same thing. Video. All right. So again. I'll change the settings and then change it back to um, 4K Ultra with hardware encoding. And because this is a 9900K, you actually have to turn on the internal graphics. So anyway, so I'm just gonna put that on export there. Get this one ready. Which one's gonna be faster? The desktop should blow it away, right? Should blow it away. I'll start the PC first quickly. I'll just go boom, export, and I'll quickly move over to, to this, export. Okay, now let's have a look at the PC. Let's go to control, alt, delete. Let's have a look here. Hardware encoding, all right, so three minutes, whatever left. And we're using, of course, the internal GPU, which is hardware encoding, probably quick sync or something like that. That's why the, you know, Final Cut Pro renders fast. And it is indeed a 9900K, what, four gigahertz, and it's, Barely using the um, RTX 2080, but it still is 30%. It's still using that in conjunction with the, you know, the Intel HD graphics. Now let's go over to the Vega. All right, this is the Mac with the Vega. Let's go up here. Let's have a look what's going on. All right, so it is slamming that Vega. Okay, if you look here, RX Vega 64 is slamming it. Uh, the internal GPU, not even using it, okay? The Vega 20, you can see, uh, 57 degrees for the um, the GPU. And the CPU, look, 2.9. It's going like really slow. 2.9, look at this one. 
4.69, eight cores, well, they're not eight cores, it's only using like 29% or whatever, and this one's using how much percent? Let's say there, 223%, oh, I don't even know what that means, why they do that? Um, okay, let's go to the power. We can see here the wattage, the fans are going really low, like only 2000 RPM, uh, CPU frequency is, yeah, okay, that's 2.7, so it's still going much lower than the PC, and we're using a total of 50 watts because obviously it's not using the internal GPU, it's using that Vega, as you can see there, it's lambing that Vega. And let's see where we are, two minutes left to go. One minute 42 left to go. And here we're using the Ultra HD graphics quite a lot. And it is using the RTX 2080. But this is the thing, right? There was always that sort of thing. Um, don't use a Mac for Premiere Pro because it's optimized for CUDA. Well, this is hardware encoding, which is the fastest way to encode, right? It's using CUDA. I was using CUDA. It must be using 35%. It just said it was using there. Of the GPU but obviously now throw that out the window Premiere Pro is much better optimized for look it's even using the internal GPU now why is it using the internal GPU that's crazy maybe I should close the lid I'm not sure it's using the internal GPU why is that for a background task or something I have no idea why is it using that anyway that Vega graphics is getting slammed, slammed hard, 1.4 gigahertz. Uh, how long we got to go? 57 seconds to go, 43, seven, 43 seconds to go here, no, 39. We'll see which one is faster. Remember, I started the uh, Mac Blast, so I started this one first, so it's like a couple of seconds behind anyway. Let's have a look, we'll wait until that gets 100%. So obviously it's much better when you can hear the Vega graphics kick up now. Listen to this. Yeah, what temperature is that running at now? 59. It's hot and muggy here in Melbourne. It's like crappy Queensland weather. Like you go outside, your hair's all wet and I hate it. Bring me to dry heat. So 99%, 100%. Here we've got 11 seconds to go. Nine seconds to go, this is still riding. We'll keep it here because we'll see. It's got to finish. It's not just sit there at 100%. Well, boom, finished, 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 boom. Oh, that just finished. So even though this started last, it's still won. A MacBook Pro with Vega just smashed a 9900K with 2080 Ti. Why do I waste my money on this thing? I'm out, I'm done. <laughs>